Former LDS Bishop was arrested by police in Virginia this week for sexually abusing his daughter in Idaho. This allegedly happened more than 20 years ago, but a grand jury has just indicted 64 year old John Goodrich. Emily Harrison with our sister station in Virginia is in Williamsburg with a look at those charges. I spoke to Williamsburg Commonwealth attorney Nate Green over the phone who confirmed to me that authorities are looking into this alleged incident that happened more than 20 years ago in the Williamsburg area. We want to warn you that some of the details may be disturbing. According to court documents, John Goodrich is accused of sexual battery, rape and sodomy of a child. Investigators believe Goodrich assaulted a child in or around the entire month of June 1999. More than 20 years ago, a grand jury indicted Goodrich which allegedly forced or intimidated this child into sexual acts. According to the Associated Press, Goodrich is a former bishop with the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints and abused the child in both a home in Idaho and on a school trip to the D.C. area 20 years ago. In that same report, the victim allegedly told church leaders about Goodrich's actions and church leaders excommunicated him. However, prosecutors in Idaho dropped the case against Goodrich after a key witness hired by the church refused to testify. Now in Virginia, the case against Goodrich is moving forward. Goodrich is now out of jail after posting a $10,000 bail. 13 News Now reached out to both Goodrich's attorney and the Williamsburg Police Department, but did not get a response back. Nate Green, Williamsburg Commonwealth attorney, says this case is part of an ongoing investigation and his office plans to look at all of the evidence. In Williamsburg, I'm Emily Harrison, 13 News Now. And Goodrich is expected back in court on April 8th.